Hello, everybody. Today in this video, I am going to be doing the Creatures of the Night game tag. Yes, if you've seen the other two, you should already guess what this is, what I'm going to be doing. Ten questions of favorite creature of the night each game. It's Halloween. Come on. People are dressing up. They're getting into the spirit. Also, today, you, you get to see my bookshelf. So this should, this should be a lot of fun to actually use my bookshelf as the backdrop. Yeah, let's, let's just get into this. Let's do this. So number one, vampires. I fail it. I completely fail. I don't have any games with vampires in it. It sucks. I don't know why. I just don't. I've looked. I've tried. It's a complete fail. <laughs> I already failed the first one. It's very sad. Very sad. So let's just move on to number two because I know I don't fail that one because number two is werewolves and yeah, Prisoner of Azkaban, there's a werewolf in this. Duh. Okay. So yeah, werewolf done. So number three is zombies and this one counts as, this one counts for zombies. Legend of Zelda, there's, there's these skeleton like things wandering around at night and they're Stalfos. They, they should, they should count. These should count as zombies like beings. They're not, like I said, they're not called zombies. They're called Stalfos, but I mean, they're, they're zombie-like, okay? They, they pop out of the ground and they try to kill you. It's mostly when you're kids, those are the kid Stalfos and then they have bigger Stalfos. So I'm counting that one. I don't care what anybody says. I'm counting that one. Zombies done. Number four, ghosts. You would think Harry Potter, but no, I'm not. I'm actually going with this because guess what's in Mario? Booze. Yeah, what are booze? Booze are ghosts, okay? Booze, booze are ghosts. They're in this. Okay, what do you want? Freaking, come on. And it's Super Mario Bros. Wii. New. So yeah, I could have picked any of my Mario games. I just, I just went with this one. Picked a random one and I went with that. So yeah, booze. Booze are ghosts. Come on. So number five is witch or wizard. And again, it's like, oh, you could do Harry Potter. Yeah, I'm not. Guess what I'm doing? Gandalf is a wizard. And in this game, in Lord of the Rings Return of the King, you actually get to play as him. You'd be a kick-ass wizard and blast people. Number six, fairy or fae. I could have gone with Ocarina of Time again for, you know, fucking Navi. She can kiss my ass along with many other people who probably agree with that. She is so effing annoying, but I'm not going to do that, even though there's also a bunch of fairies, but I am going to go with Wind Waker. I'm gonna go with that one. Yeah, there's fairies. There's there's a bunch of fairies in here, fairy fountains and whatnot. There's fairies in almost every All Zelda games. Come on. So now we have number seven, which is Demon. If you saw the book one, it, I actually combined that one with the other. But this one is like the very crappy Dreamcast console that did not do well. And it's Marvel vs. Capcom. And there's there's a female character. I, I can't pronounce her ca name correctly in this, so I'm not going to. But there's, there's a character in here and she's a demon. She is a demon. Trust me on this. She's a freak demon. I'm pretty sure she's a demon in this. All right, that one done. So now we have angels. And this one actually took me a while because I thought like, oh, I don't have angels. I failed this one too. That's not good. Uh, yeah, I do actually technically have one pit in Super Smash Brothers Brawl. I don't have the actual pit games, but he's, he's an angel. He's considered one. Going with that. Why the hell not? He's an angel. Shut up. Okay, alien. This one I had trouble with because I thought I didn't have something, but you know, I do. I mean, this should count. Kurt B64, the crystal shards. I mean, you go to different planets and technically by going to different planets, you're technically an alien. Kirby's an alien to all those other planets and then all those planets are aliens to him. So why the hell not? I mean, that, that should count. Come on. And now number 10, which is super powered human. Super Street Fighter 4. Basically everybody in here is essentially a human. Not almost all of them are humans in this and they're super powered humans. Pretty much almost all of them. Some are not. Some are actually like mystical beings of some kind. The majority of these are humans. That's all the games. All the games I'm going to be doing. This is such a bad angle. Oh my god. That's all of them. That's all of them except for the vampire one. I gotta put these down. That was a bad angle. As for tagging anybody, I don't have a specific person to tag, but I will tag any of you if you want to do this. So if any any viewers who want to do this tag, you can go do it. So if any of you want to do this, go do it. It's fun. It's a lot of fun to get your games out and show them off and see like what different games you all come up with for stuff. It's fun. For the book one and the movie one, the links will be, you know, down below in the description area or they'll be at the end of the video. So go, go and click those, go and click the links, go watch those videos to see what's different, to see what's similar. It's a lot of fun. That is it for this video. I will see you all in the next one.